learned that. I learned that. The coolest thing I learned today was. My favorite thing today that I saw in the planetarium was. The constellations. My favorite was Aja Jacques the Crane. How, like, it's so easy to find in the sky. The four stars that make the body, they're just like super easy to find because they make one perfect square. It was so much fun and I really like it. I want to come back next time. Every single elementary student gets the opportunity to come here. So in a typical year, I will see around 9,000 St. Paul students. So um, that's why it's important to me that what's happening here is um, a high quality. And um, I also feel like any improvements or adjustments that we do have this far reaching impact. Planetarium received American Rescue Plan funding for a curriculum to be updated, for collaborations to happen with that curriculum update that makes it um, of higher integrity. Not having had um, really any indigenous culture taught in school to me growing up, um, to be able to come to the planetarium and be able to share that with students, to be able to share stories of the winter maker and see them um, getting excited about that, it's, it, it really means a lot to me because a narrative that has been absent for most of my lifetime is now being front and center and being taught to all students in St. Paul. It's very exciting. A man that had like a long arm and that throws snowballs. That one was cool. It was called Winter Maker. Winter Maker. He um, makes snow. They didn't know like how to just like what it meant or how they could just like say it. So they just kept the name that was native to it. Because one's Ojibwe and the other is English. In Ojibwe culture, we have a star pattern that we see in the winter time called the Winter Maker. Um, other cultures may know this star pattern as Orion. And in the story of Shingabis that um, that I tell in the planetarium, um, the Winter Maker is trying to um, outsmart the little Shingabis the duck, and he's going to go fishing, and he's going to. Um, figure out ways to adapt to the ice and the snow. And, and the lesson we can learn from that is how, as Minnesotans, we are resilient to ice and snow. A student may say, oh, I know that one is Orion. And, and the response would be, you know, that's one name for it. Here's another name for it. Cultures across the world have other names for it. Um, what other, you know, other students in the group, do you know this star constellation as another name? So it's really bringing in uh, the culture of children to identify what uh, different cultures call that same constellation. For me, when I look at it, I'm like, well, science concept-wise, we can still do all, we can talk about seasons and how our southern constellations change, um, but we're just going to place it within the context of our Ojibwe constellations. It's important for children to be able to bring their own culture into the lesson because that's their identity and so that they're, they're recognized for what their beliefs are. All students benefit from learning the indigenous stories because these stories are native to Minnesota. These are stories that um, about our time and place, where they've been passed down. This is where we live. These are the stories of, of this area. And so for all students to learn that, um, I think really connects them to Minnesota history. If they're learning about Orion, that's, that's history from another part of the world. If they're learning about the Winter Maker, the Babunicon, that's a story from Minnesota. In summer, me and my dad go stargazing in the giant field next to our house, so I might be able to find Aja Shock. If you looked at the Milky Way, you could see it by just making a T. If you look sideways, it kind of looks like an X. The advantage of using the computer software is you can take that spaceship view and see things from another, a second perspective. So um, it's an ant, it's adding to what we understand and see in our skies and in our world. Um, and I see that as well as, as we have native um, knowledge that we are 
adding to what students are seeing and understanding about their world. So it's, it's things that go together and it's helping them see even more.